Hello everyone, and thank you for rejoining me here in Crusader Kings 3, playing as that beautiful monster. Hopefully, though, we will become Ireland soon enough. Uh, we got a couple comments to get through, so last time we conquered a little bit more territory. We actually did a little spin-to-win strategy to fight off uh, the Earldom of Dublin, in which we really don't like him. He's my nephew, and he's a real kind of a douchebag. Uh, but him attacking us could have been a much worse thing. Uh... At this point, with this third episode, we got to start thinking about long term. Now, it was recommended I could take out all the Isles. I don't know if I really will be able to. I don't know Crusader Kings 3 that well, but I'm here to learn and probably going to make a few mistakes. Denmark is looking pretty thick, though. Wow. They're led by Sven. Cool. And yeah, he doesn't really care for us that much, though. Wow, that's a lot of guys. Um, I'd like to ally with England, obviously, but he's looking... A, he's, he's pretty young. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah. King Robert, huh? Now, we also have Scotland up here. I want to ally with one of these guys, but we'll see what happens. But in this episode, I think it'd be okay if we took out this group. But really focus on long-term, like, like I'm trying to say. And it was recommended that I build up my castle area a little bit more. They're always going to attack the castle area, my, my capital, really. And with that in mind, we can construct a new duchy building. But let's get some more stuff. We need to get some more money first. And we're doing pretty well in money. But I'm going to hurt ourselves just a little bit and spend a little bit more time building ourselves up. Because our military, while we do have 1,300 soldiers some, their levies, and honestly, levies are they're okay. They're not great. So, and we have seven knights, which is nice. But we're going to create me new men-at-arms regiments, uh, which will help us, hopefully, beat up enemy soldiers. Now, we can't afford all these guys. Uh, let's see. Onagers are good for sieges, I believe. Yes, plus point for a day. Mangonels would be very good as well. So I'm going to spend a little bit of money first. And I, as much as I would like armored... Oh, those guys look pretty good. These guys counter spearmen or pikemen. Hmm. Light footmen would not be bad to have. Especially in jungle, taiga, and forests. I'm going to grab one thing of... Well, actually, you know what? Compared to levies, they're not that much better. Eh, they're okay. Pursuit's not bad. Screen's not bad. Toughness, damage. I really want armored... Footmen, because they lay down some heavy, heavy stuff. They can't pursue anything, but they're pretty good. So right now, we're just going to hang out and build ourselves up. My goal is to get more money, afford things, because plus 5.6 is not bad. My prisoners died in my dungeon. Uh, how many people do I have in my dungeon? In the meantime, we have religious relations. We can convert this Catholic province over to our religion, but we're not going to do that now, mostly because I want to get a claim on this region here, because I think that would be good. If we could get a claim... Take this person out because they're actually not that strong. Uh, he kind of likes us, actually. He's our neighboring ruler. He's greedy. And he's not that strong. And he doesn't look like he has any alliances. So that's good to take him out now. Anything else up here? We can create some uh, titles. We're working on control in Breifne. And powerful vassal demands council representatives. Oh, I gained prestige. Nice. You gained 30 opinion of you for five years. Uh, cool. Vassal, marshal, knight. Awesome. Oh, go. Oh. Crap, I'm being raided? First raiders? Ooh. So they have some levies. They have some skirmishers. Now, if I were to raise my armies up now, we could probably beat the snot out of him. The sacking? Uh, let's pay 30. Help them rebuild. I lose money. Uh, let's see, you're gaming. I curse these people. <sighs> Fine, god dang it. I really don't want to do this. Oh! Oh crap, we actually are in a battle. Uh, let's see. My brothers died. Alliance has expired. Petty Queen inspires recruitment. Please let us win. Oh, we're gonna win, hopefully. Oh crap. Well, I can no longer sway the mayor. He's dead. Well, okay. Raid, loot, recovered. I captured 75 gold worth of loot. That cost us quite a bit. That cost us quite a bit. Holy cow. We won, that's nice, but at the same time, at what cost? <laughs> Seriously, what cost? Jesus Christ, increase opinion? Um, sure, that's fine. Might as well, right? So we got a little bit of our loot back, which is nice. Let's go ahead and build this area up then. We have cattle lands. Ooh. Well, let's close that out. Outpost, defender advantage, that would be bad. Light cavalry, heavy, heavy infantry is nice. Let's see, damage. A soldier's damage determines how many casualties they can inflict upon the enemy during a battle. Uh, Levy Soldier, of course, does 10. I like skirmishes. I like all this. I really want Trade Port. I would really like that. But... I want more money. And because I want to get more soldiers... 
I think having levies up here wouldn't be too bad. I really want more money. I, I want to be kind of greedy right now. <laughs> but we're going to get attacked eventually anyways. And it's always good to help out your capital. So, Actually, new duchy building would not be bad. Army maintenance, number of knights, knight effectiveness would not be bad either. Marches, defender advantage. Also, rate time plus 20%. Garrison size would be pretty nice as well. Ooh, there's so much I want to do here. Our men at arms maintenance minus six percent does not sound bad either. This one seems pretty good as well. Blacksmiths. I also like chateau because it gives you more control, which is okay. Monthly prestige is nice. Stress, loss, stress, stress, loss. Holding taxes is not bad either. <sighs> Always so many things I want to do, but let's go ahead. This gives you money and gives you better defender advantage and light cavalry, which would not be bad. Ooh. Oh, I'm tempted. I'm really tempted. Hunting grounds. Uh, let's see. Let's preview it. So, if we do this, you can constantly get more levies and more light cavalry, which would not be bad. More money, more money, more money. At that point, honestly, by level 3, it, it could still be worth it. Light cavalry is not bad to get, but... Hmm... Actually, hold on. So, let's look at the... We have plains, we've got plains, we've got hills... Hills. There's a lot of plains and hills around here. So there doesn't look like there's going to be that much... There's wetlands in some of these places here. Which isn't bad. Hmm. And let's take a look up here before I make any... I know I'm taking a while with this. I just want to make sure that we do, you know, a good thing. Um, and do play well. Light horsemen. They are good against archers. They're not bad, actually. They're not good in wetlands. They're not good in deserts, mountains, or hills. But they're good in drylands and plains. So they get advantage in plains... I really want armored footmen. Because these are considered heavy infantry. And they have no terrain effects. I've got to go with the infantry. I probably do. Right? Like oh, how would you get money? Money. Money, man. Money. Oh. Yeah, honestly, it, it doesn't matter. Let's get just let's get this one. That'd be for the best. Just we start building it now. And we have any more days left? Good. Disband the armies. Make some more money now. We just gotta be ready. We just have to be ready. Ooh. You're a fighter. Can I maybe recruit to courts? Pay 25? Sure. Why not? Uh, educate a child, sway, murder, grant titles, demand, dismiss. Can I demand? Oh, yeah, he will accept. Great. He's now insular Christianity. And I asked you guys that yesterday regarding whether I should convert to regular Christianity or Catholicism now or later. Ooh, Scotland's not having a good time. Honestly, uh, I don't know a whole lot at the time of this recording about, like, relationships. I don't know you improve relationships, but how to get marriages with other countries and get alliances. I guess it's just through your sons and daughters, but... Um, but regardless, Catholicism, I will convert to Catholicism once we are done. Oh, do not think this is... Oh, I don't really care. Whatever. Oh, good. How commendable. I will convert to regular Catholicism or when we are done. When we're done with all of Ireland, and then we'll convert. That is my plan. That is definitely my plan. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. If, oh, we got to wait till how much? 125. If we wait a few more months, we'll have it. And guys, our superior quality. Greetings, Petty King Milchad Munster. See it done. We lose some money. Oh. I don't want to lose money, though. We're in debt, which is not good, which actually increases corruption. You can designate a guardian. Uh, my wife is pretty good, so. Convert culture? Um, she's Welsh, so how about not? Convert faith. Convert to Petty Queen's faith, Catholicism. Catholicism. C Catholicism. Uh, title created, low country, you are in debt. Yeah, I know. Cannot declare war while we're in debt. Well, within four, mo four months, we'll have it done. Hey, new lifestyle park. Which is cool. Soldiers less fortunate. Mercenary high cost could be really good. It could be very, very good. Prepare conscription. Army maintenance goes down. Uh, friendly territory. Levy reinforcement rate. Yes, please. Oh, look at that. Even more money. Plus six. Nice. Very, very nice. Ah, now we're positive on money, which is great. Titles can be created, which I might do if we can do it later on. We can declare war on the Earl for now. Does he have any allies? No, he does not. Our claims. We get the title of that, which would be great. We get some fame. Uh, cost of 63 prestige, which is fine with me, and he's vastly, vastly inferior. Give me another month. New year, new us, new war. And someone to add to our lands, please. They love attacking us. I kind of just want to beat him up. Now, attacking in here is probably a really not good idea. You 
can't even siege it down, so that's okay with me. Or actually, can't siege it down, which is not good, but we should be able to siege his home before he sieges us. Yeah, oh yeah, look at that. It's 300, wow. Ours is 300 too, so. Can't dispute, after my army sets up camp, I hear a commotion coming from my night's lodgings. To investigate the disturbance, I find Brian and Earl Olaf in the middle of a heated argument while several onlookers edge them on. Deliver a speech about unity, 39% chance of getting prestige and martial life experience, and 60% chance that we spend 75 prestige and the fighting escalates. Have them both whipped, we get some experience, they lose opinion of us, they both get wounded. Uh, saw this, I'm going to my tent and stuffing my ears. You know what? We're probably going to spend 75 prestige. For all, my, my pleas for us to all put aside our differences, fall onto fears. As the spat turns into an all out brawl, drinking and food go flying as people start throwing tankards and packs around. Might as well join in 6% chance we gain prestige and experience. 94% chance I get injured, wounded, I get experience and lose stress. What a mess. Just spend it, whatever. Uh, who's going to win here first? 27-1. Oh, he actually is probably going to win first. Oh, that sucks. Seriously? How did he do that first? Well, we won regardless. And that's not good for that they captured my court, but you know what? To hell with this guy. Yeah, my courtier was killed in the siege, yeah. That was another comment from yesterday. Don't let him capture your stuff. That's why I want to build this area up even more. Got a release, good. Siege 1, new bishop, that's fine. Uh, council, whatever. 15, that's not bad, actually. Fabricate claim, convert faith. Don't convert faith here. For, uh, actually, don't, don't convert faith. Don't do that. Instead, fabricate claims on... Who are we going to go to war with next? Before we make any rash decisions to spend all armies, it's fine. We want more money. So that looks pretty good. And actually, is that under us immediately? Yes, it is. It is direct, one of my direct holdings. Now, Ulster. Let's go by this guy. Feudal. He's alone. Can I go to war with this guy? No, we need to claim. So we're going to claim his territory. That'll be good. Your chaplain's current task, convert faith. Yes, that's fine. Over here, anything else? Control it has to be better over here. That's fine. We're supporting schemes. Uh, mm, what are my schemes? Court. Entry. It's an under entry. Sway him. Discovered schemes. None yet. Let's come back over here and do that for now. That'll be good. Domestic affairs. Foreign affairs. That's fine. Now, that's not bad. That's not bad. We're of high quality. Military-wise, we still can't afford the knights. Levies are okay. They're just not good. They're high quality, but they can only do so much. Ooh. Marshal impresses the vassal. That's good. Wooden barracks constructed. Awesome. We got some wooden barracks. Which gets us even more levies, which is good. But our heavy infantry and spearmen do more damage, which is ideal. Now, next up, we're going to... Oh. Let's finish the increased control. Good job. Great job. Great, 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 great. And now, I have a job for you to do over here. You might as well get increased control. Alright, so it looks like we got enough money. Let's go ahead and do this. It costs money just to have them. When they're not even using them, they cost 1.2 a month for full maintenance, but when they're unraised, it's only 0.4, which is not bad. And this is one of the things that I overlooked early on that I did not know about, was recruiting actually good units. Levies are great and all are in the early game, or sometimes, but uh, getting actual units here, uh, that's what we need. 1.2 a month, maybe? Full maintenance is 1.2. Nice. A demonstration of leadership. My Marshal Earl Murdoch has been hovering around my council meetings lately. Knowing his interest in my matters of leadership, I cannot help but feel that this man is waiting for me to impress him. I could... <coughs> Excuse me. I could probably engage him in conversation. On the other hand, it might be better for him to simply see me interacting with my men. There is something to be said for at least pretending to know every soldier's face. Let's discuss methods of communication. Or respected figurehead. Uh, it's only two years. Let's get some more opinion and then some more life experience. Beautiful, my friends. Soldiers are less fortunate. Absolute control. Huh. I'm not sure what that does. Stalwart leader is not bad. Reduces the risks of commanding armies. I like that actually a lot because he is fighting the armies. Overseer? Well, I don't know what that does, and I want to see I want to I want to get that. Oh wait. Oh, maybe we can do strategist as well. Yeah, that wouldn't be bad either. Happy 1084, my friends out. My counselor's dead. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Spy master. Well, who's good at spying? You are. I don't want to lose my knight though. I don't mind recruiting this person then. For twenty bucks? That's fine. There you go. Looking great right there. Nice. We're about ready to get these guys. So going to war is going to be a little bit more expensive than normal, but that's okay. See it done. We lose 75 monies. So, so be it. Whatever. We're in debt. It's fine. I don't care. Uh, we can declare war. Low ca country control. Whatever. Alright, so. 
In the meantime, we can convert faith, but we're not going to do that. Religious relations. Let's get more piety. Earn respect. Great. We're doing really well. Ireland is so far not a difficult nation to really start off at, or a monster, really. But we'll see what happens. Oh, who gets more opinion of me? Well, the mayor does. I think that's enough. What I want to do, maybe. What about the king? Oh, England's having some. Ooh. Hello. Who's fighting? Uh, Mercia is fighting. Maybe I could s sway her and get better relations with her. She looks very, very powerful, but she is a sinner. Wow. She claims to be Catholic, but mine is 522 Catholic points or piety. Woo, mama. What do you do? Oh, you're wounded. Uh, you're wounded. You're... Mm, she's a seductress. She's an adulterer. Her spouse... Oh, man, he looks rough. Holy cow. He's Irish. Oh. Amateur plotter, vengeful, gluttonous. So she's a fat seducer. Hmm. She knows how to eat, huh? Cool. So that looks pretty good. Let's go ahead. Come over here. Betrothed, huh? Neighbor ruler. Does he have any allies? No, he does not. We're going to press our claims. It's going to cost us 31 prestige. But he's vastly inferior, which is great. Now it's going to cost us quite a bit to raise armies, but honestly, not that much. Just five monies, which is a lot. That's okay, though. It's all for a good cause. And we're probably going to win any battle here. Oh, uh, here we go. So, almost 2,100 versus less than 500. Light. So he has light footmen, huh? But we have... Oh, armored footman, but let's see, deals 10% damage due to being countered, because they are not good against light footmen. So it's good to diversify your infantry to a degree, or just your army in general, you know. That is fine, our guy died, that sucks, that actually really sucks. Uh, let's see, recruit to court, your guest. He's zealous, which I don't necessarily like. How much money do we have? Ten oh, that's fine, Ten. Heck, heck yeah. There you go. Kind of handsome. Cool. And they're probably going to try to come to my capital again. So that means I'm going to probably try to get... So we spent one upgrade just defending our capital, increasing the size of our capital's garrisons. And they can't even see just down, which is great. Oh, oh, who's that? With Count of Guineas? Guinness? Oh, he's died. So we spent one upgrade. Then we spent money on getting those basically heavy infantry. Not bad, right? Oh, my prisoner has died in my dungeon. Oh. And actually, I might take a power... Mm, I don't want to do that. So, the next upgrade I want to spend money on, if we can, is so that we can actually increase the amount of money we make. Because I want to get an even larger army. So, I think that would be good and probably a smart thing to do. Hooks you hold. Uh, let's see. Remove guardian and range. Find spouse. Um, murder. Imprison. Disinherit. Inherit. Oh, who is this? Secret enemy. Is a non-believer. Blackmail for a hook? Uh, let's see. Can I do anything else here? Blackmail. Grant titles. Dismiss. If he declines, the secret will be exposed. I mean, you're a non-believer. Lost oh, 15 opinion of me. That's fine. I could expose him. Exposing a secret, that's fine. I never really tried this, though. So. Court stuff. Court physician. Um, our guests. Claimants. Oh, I have prisoners. Oh, you know, Okay. Can I ransom you? I get a weak hook uh, for a favor. You know what? It's fine. See you later. You. I just want to ransom you people off. No, no one cares about you. Who is you, your prisoner? Uh, Schwabian, huh? Uh, let's see. Hedwig. Negotiate release. It's fine. Can I not ransom these people for money, I guess? Leaves prison for a favor. It's fine. Agatha? I'm not even sure why I keep them there. To me, they cost money to be in prison. I mean, yeah, it's cool. Prisoner and rival. Oh. Mm, she does not like me. She's my rival. So, we'll, we'll keep her there. We'll keep her there for now. Mass release. Mass ransom. Mm, oh, oh, she's a brilliant strategi strategist. Well, I'm not Nora, so I can't take her as my concubine. That'd be kind of wild. She's my rival, but she's my concubine at the same time. That sounds like fun. I'm not going to lie. That sounds like a lot of fun. But anyways. Ransom. Yeah. No. Mm, Irish. There's a lot of Irish folk here. Then again, we are in Ireland. I could mass execute these people. Actually, could I... Oh, I spent 100 piety. All of my guests lose opinion of me. 
Can I ransom this person? Well, that doesn't really matter, honestly. Task group. Oh, nice. Increase control. Um, in prison for three years. You know what? I could torture. Mm. I could torture them, huh? Just go and uh, ransom. That's fine. Uh, what is she? Who is this person? Albina? Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. I don't care. I really don't care. I just want to. Yeah, they can't do anything to our capital, so. Cool. Nice, we won. I'll capture this person. Can I ransom you? Uh, give me your money. Nice. Cool. And next up, we gotta go do what, where? Ah, the city. Right? Oh, yes, we can see this down. It's fine, too. Get a hook. They can't do anything over there, which is great. Take all the loot you can. We need more loot. Oh, so look at Mary. This is my grandson, Fearless Lackey. So he is Great Eminence. Who is good in diplomacy? I took my foe, Earl Coleman, hostage during the siege of Don Padraig. Humble. He's humble. I like that. He's content, which is good. And then he's brave. It's, this sounds like a great person. Uh, alliance power. Let's see. Union, innocence, and splendor. Is this Welsh? Okay. Uh, let's see. Potential alliance. Let's claim it to the following things. Let's see. Hmm. Navarra. Basque. Who is that? It's Lombard. Breton. What is this? Claims on the... Ooh. Oh, what is that? Triumph is liberty. French. Oh, England's trying to do some work down here. What is it? Up in Upper Burgundy's down here, too? Oh, man. Iberia is a mess. Holy cow. I really want to get married into one of these families over here. So, hold on. Oh, I can call in my ally? I don't need that right now. Kingdom of England's looking kind of a mess. I really want to marry, like, whoever's here. What, betrothed? How old are you? You're 12. She's 50. What the? That's right. It's Crusader Kings. Um. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm, Gwynedd. Who is your heir? What's your heir? Spouse. Does anyone want to get married? Well, we'll see what happens. Well, I don't know. Let's go back to Alliance Power. She's seven. He's how old? He's 16. Gwynedd. Would that be okay? Oh, he gets some prestige. That's fine. We really like the Welsh. Excelente. This okay, do anything... Oh against us over there. Keep sieging it down. Good. And we'll come over here next. And finish off this war. Oh, available perks. Nice. So we can actually grab this. What a strategist. You get three more marshal, one diplomacy, enemy fatal casualties, and crosses with water without penalties. That's not bad. You get even more marshal, which gives you 32 points every month. How do you get more points? Unlockable boons. It's looking to focus within a lifestyle. Experience. Oh, it's accumulated passively by holding a focus selected or granted by events. Different types of this. It might be good just to get even more Marshall, so we can quickly get more and more, even though our guy's getting really old at this point. Oh man, he's getting old. Strategist? I guess why not. 26? That's not bad. Even though it doesn't get more every month, that's fine. Ah, running low on, for the garrison. Someone died. Duke? A Gwyneth. Oh, that sucks. Nice, we got it. Force demands. I get the title. So be it. Nice. How many titles do I have under me? How old am I? I am 59. I am getting old. Uh, let's see. This guy. Can I grant him a title, maybe? Uh, maybe I'll grant him Ulster? Grab him that, give him that one for now. Just because I want to make sure that he actually gets everything. My heir. Yeah, he's going to get it anyways. Mm, maybe not. Hold on everything for now. Spend whatever we can. Nice. So, Meath is going to be a problem. They're not allied with anyone. If I want to go to war with them, uh, it might be best if we do this first, of course. But then, fabricate a claim on his county just so that we have it if we need it in the future. So, now with all this extra money, 7.7. <gasps> My queen! She pregnant! So, we got that. That's not bad. 
Over, if we're gonna fight in his lands, he has plains, plains, hills, hills. He's got a lot of hills and a lot of plains. He's got a little bit of wetlands. Not bad, not bad. You know, our, this place is a mess over there. It is England, what do you expect? Oh, just saying, just saying, whatever. Never been, I'd like to go someday. Cattle lands, we want to increase the mon amount of money we're making. That's not bad, building construction gold cost. I like that as well. Uh, I really want to build up this area though. So let's see, what about over here? City-wise, what can we build? Anything is plus 0.3, plus 0.2, plus 0.5, plus 0.3. Development cost, guilds, trade port. What about over here? Anything, oh, we actually have stuff over here. Uh, let's see, anything else? This is my direct capital. These are the places that I administer directly from. Oh, he already has one over here? That's not bad. Outposts. Plus point two is just not very much, man. I'll be honest. It ain't much. Is there anything else I can do over here? Probably not. 300 monies? That's a lot of monies we don't got. Anything else? Another building is... Oh, maybe... Another building is already construction, huh? Okay. And how about over here? Anything over here? Probably the same, same, same type of stuff. It's fine, whatever. Uh... Construct new duchy building. Yeah, I'd like to, but it doesn't give us any more money, and I want more money. That's point two. Defender advantage, light cavalry. I'm I'm tempted to make light cavalry. Development speed, development wise, we are doing okay. It's not great. Monthly growth is just just a little bit. We do have pastoral isolation, which is not ideal. Country capital, Thalman is wetlands. Uh, that doesn't help. Uh, light cavalry or development. Well, actually, we get plus point three, which is uh, fine. Do that. And then we're going to get another military upgrade once we're done here. Uh, lost in its inefficient census. That's fine. That's fine. And our guy is probably going to die eventually. Splitting up a lot of this. Sway, Anglo-Saxon culture. A commoner of Anglo-Saxon heritage has been accosted in the streets of Loinenek over some minor offense. By making a statement in their defense, I could perhaps convince the Duchess Agathid of Mercia, the equally Anglo-Saxon of my good character, but I might risk alienating my Ingl Irish peers. Uh, spend some prestige, 40% chance. That's not bad. I'm gonna lose prestige eventually, so... We might as well try to establish good relations with her for now, but then again, we're gonna die anyways. I must say I've come to see the new light. Perhaps... Oh, cool. My son! Ah, oh, a new son, man. My my wife got some some big old cheeks. Oh, we're doing after an ancestor. Bledin. Ah, hopefully he's my son. Oh, simple bishop. Well, that's not ideal. Four issues. Let's see. Cool. We could do that, but... Mm, he's only minus 20. He doesn't want to see the like, council. 16, 16. Oh, this guy's okay. Which I... Brianin? He's my nephew and steward. He's not that great. Not gonna lie. My This is better. Yeah, definitely do that once we get more money. I want more money right now. Oh, as much money as possible. Sway. A misunderstanding. It seems that my diplomatic overtures towards the Duchess has caused a major, ma major, major understanding. Man, she was looking a little old, but she got some big cheeks too. I've received a letter which makes it clear that she thinks I've been pursuing a different goal entirely. Well, I am flattered. I find your interest inappropriate for a man of your station. I do not need to read on to get to the point. Oh, come on. What? I just want to sway her? Sway that seducing mama, that's all. That's all I want. Finish the fabricate claim? Great. See it done. Beautiful. So, we've got that done for now, the great duelist. My vassal, Mayor Dolgus, has arrived at the court with a bandaged arm and fear in his eyes. He tells me that my son and heir, Brian, has been challenging people to duels all over Innis. Please forgive me, my lord, but this has to stop. Brian uh, turned up at my doorstep and challenged me. I had no choice but to accept. This is not the first time either. I am but the last in a long line of victims. Wow, he's not looking good. Is that my son? Oh, good job, man. You're 39? Yeah, kick his butt. These duels will cease at once. Uh, a dangerous pastime. You need an instructor. The mayor loses opinion, and I lose money, but he gets, my son gets a better opinion. Aspiring Blade Master. Keep challenging people to duels. Your father will show you how it's done. Prowess challenge against Brian. Brian. I defeat him. I, there's a 40% chance to lose. You need an instructor. I, I lost money. God dang it. Uh, that's okay. And I died. See, I knew that would happen. It eventually continues. Petty King Brian II. <clears throat> he died at the age of 61. My son is 40. Alright, so this is going to be new and different for me. <clears throat> Excuse me, my voice it keeps uh, acting up. Alright, so. Low County Control and Ulster. That's fine. Let's deal with this. This is my first time I've... Well, not the first time I've ever had to deal with this. But, uh, I'm already trying to get more control, it looks like, in different places. Oh, crap. Do I have to reconquer this place? Oh, don't tell me I have to reconquer this place. I'm going... I'm in line to Harry... 
inherit titles. Usurp? Zero out of two counties. Oh, crap. So we lost a lot. Hmm. I cannot go to war. Oh, wait. His claims. My claims. No cost, but I can't go to war yet. I can. Oh, I'm in. I'm in debt. I'm in. Why am I in debt? Oh, new bishop. I don't like this. I don't like it when my ruler dies. Son, heir, and knight. Vassal and knight. Uh, you know what? He's, if he's my heir, assign him to that position so he doesn't get himself killed off. Mm, oh, I can create the Kingdom of Ireland. Oh, but I need more money. Oh, uh, create a kingdom. Oh, let's get a guardian for this person. My son. Uh, me? I could do it myself, but this looks pretty good. Hungarian? My, oh, no, 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 no. Zealous. I don't like that. They really don't like us. Finish? Eh, I'll we'll do that one. Give it a month, and we shall go to war if we can. What's over? Oh, no last no chosen. Okay, so we're going to probably go down the same thing. 20% more experience. Eh, it's not that great. Hey, he's already going down this way. Overseer? No martial perk unlock. Well, that's okay. We'll get one eventually. Alright, educating the child. That's good. Factions. Do we have any factions here? No, that's good. Ah, uh, my poor king. Uh, we should probably try to get these people to like us a little bit more first. Wants a seat on the council. He's not bad in l learning. Wow, congrats. You're good at learning. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Hmm. Within the realm. If anything, let's make this guy... Let's sway him. Because that seems pretty easy and he'll stay with us. But for you. My half-brother. Cost 38. Uh, gets a contested title. What is a contested title? Uh, what is it? There we go. You get a weak hook on her. Zero fame. And gain nothing. But I either have my claims. You get Petty Kingdom of Kolnak. I want this back, you son of a gun. The Petty Kingdom? The Earldom? <laughs> Why would I just want the Earldom of Brifna? That looks pretty bad. That just looks even worse. The Petty Kingdom is what we want. We're going to go to war immediately and see what we can do. We're going to raise all armies. We are looking pretty... not bad. Let's see what happens. Oh, I thought I chose this. Oh, I need to choose one of these. Marshal. Uh, more dread gain. More control. That would be bad. Prowess. Uh, we don't get any more Marshal here. Marshal experience. 30 a month. I would like more Marshal since he is leading. I'm just going to choose this one again like I did earlier. I think that would be for the best. Oh, the other one also is given rise to peasant rabble. That's not ideal. Uh, I will probably win defending wetlands, but we have more than double the army size, so I'm not too worried about it. There we go. Uh, over here. Let's go and take his capital first and see what happens. A curse undone. The twists and turns of fate have not always been to my advantage. God knows that I was cursed today I met Mayo Dalgus. Today, however, that curse has been lifted. Fate has smiled upon me and brought the vile churn to his grave. Not one day too soon. Great. My rival's dead. Long live me. Someone else. Oh, my wife. Petty Queen Beatrice is once again absent from her chambers as night falls. She has been distant lately, lost in thought, and rarely seen at court. Am I not to her satisfaction? Is she simply busy, or could she be warming someone else's bed? Do you have another Beatrice? I confront her. Every move will be watched. Um. Yeah, let's, let's look around. See what's going on. And they're so weak, they can't do anything there. Small harbor, great! We have a small harbor. More money. Good stuff like that. Hey, we took, we took a child. Which, if you heard that in a different perspective, or from a different perspective, that could sound really, really bad. If you, And never mind, I don't want to get arrested. Anyways, let's see. Uh, decisions, those are always fun. Amnesty for false conversions. Crypto religionists may reveal their hidden faiths. Take vow of poverty. Nah, I'm all about that money right now. I want money, 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 money. Fon Roe, who are you? And we'll end this episode once we finish this war off. In house arrest, you're a prisoner, honorable adventurer. Can I ransom you away? Can I afford the fourth th full thing? It's fine with me. Give me all your cash. Petty King? Uh, who are you? Imprisoned by me. Can we ransom you? Well, that's okay. She'll like us more when we do that. You? Can I ransom you? Leaves of prison. What if I ransom the Petty King? Offer peace? Claim title. 
Dynasty, their dynasty. Oh, my dynasty has. Oh. Um. Imprisoned. Can I ransom you? One. No. I'm not going to do that. Good deal. And they still can't do anything down there. So. Greetings. There's not. Switches to disrupt schemes. Continue to try to find things. You never know. Maybe she's good. Maybe she's a good wife. She probably is. But you never know. England is looking really bad, though. I like that. Beautiful. Now, let's let's stop wasting time. Enforce demands. I get my title back. So be it. And Ireland is looking not too bad. Also, let's see. Can we can we create it? Oh, we need more money. Oh, crap. Oh, and before we do that, let's disband all the armies. We have won the war. Finish the task, which was... Oh, finding secrets. Anything else here? Control? Money? I think we're looking pretty darn good. So I hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And tomorrow, we will attempt to form the nation of Ireland. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.